I'm here with Dr. Jim Stefani with Muscle and Fitness. Uh, Jim is the person that I go to for advice on training, nutrition, and supplementation. So we're here walking around the expo with the Muscle and Fitness strength bands, having some of the bodybuilders here at the show try the bands, see how difficult they are to use. So I want to come over to Jim here, have him give us an explanation of why the bands are so difficult. Yeah, the reason, one of the main reasons why the bands are so difficult is because, simply put, they get harder the further you stretch them. That means when you go to do an exercise, it's misleading how much resistance you actually have until you get through the full range of motion. So am I going to try this here? For example. He's got less resistance than he does at the top. With free weights, you've got the same resistance with full range of motion. You can see how difficult this is for James. Everything's difficult about for me. 60 pounds at the top. Which feels a lot heavier than 60 pounds. Exactly. <sighs> to, me, that's, to me, that's much more difficult than free weights. And again, the reason is, as you go through that range of motion, you start recruiting more muscle fibers because the resistance gets harder. You can't do that with free weights. With free weights, you recruit more muscle fibers as you get to the end of the set. With resistance bands, you actually recruit more muscle fibers through a single rep. From start to finish, you're recruiting more muscle fibers as you get to the top. That makes sense. For more tips on training and nutrition, catch Muscle and Fitness Raw with Dr. Jim Stefani on MuscleandFitness.com. Thank you, Jim. I really appreciate it. My pleasure, James. I got Brandon Curry here with me. How you doing, Brandon? Good right, to see you, man. Good, good. All right, so we've got our uh, Muscle and Fitness strength bands here. Everyone keeps asking us, how challenging are these really? So we're going to go ahead and put Brandon to the test here. So you want to do the same as me, or you want to go a little heavier? I'm the same as you. Uh, <laughs> I'm no fool. <laughs> I don't work with bands. I work with man resistance. What's your idea? So what do you think? That's, that's not easy, is it? No, it's not easy. I work with bands before, and I change same concept. But no, it's not easy. It's definitely the taller you are, the worse it will be. True. Yeah. Very true. Wow. It's, yeah, that's why you got to do them in front. Yeah. So we got Anthony here, also from BSN. So uh, let's try something different. You want to do some bicep curls, Mike? No, no bicep curls. Okay. Yeah. Just call, man. Just with, resist with, the with, with the black. With the black. With the black. With the black and the orange. Black and the orange. If can I can do, do that though? I don't know. If I, I don't can know. Do. Okay, Anthony. I think he can do it. Let me let me demonstrate with the orange first. Okay. All right. So Mike, is it better to cross these? Bicep? Nah, just keep them straight. So just a wide stance, wide though, right? Stance, yeah. Accomplish a full body workout with these. Wide stance, full body workout. So just a wide stance. What are you gonna do? That's it. All right, but you're not doing this. Okay. All right. All right. Same, same thing. I'm, to I'm only a buck seventy-five. So. Okay. Me too. All right. <laughs> well, let's see what we got. All right. So you guys are distributing. These are brand new. You can buy these on strengthbands.com. Okay. Okay, cool. Check it out. I just trained arms too, so it could be a little difficult. All right, so what you want to do is take that wide stance because you want to feel resistance even in the <laughs> Try some shoulders too. With the, with the double. No, no, no. I'll, I'll go easy on. I'll All go right, easy on. Break a sweat. All right. There you go. So okay. same thing. You can take a narrower stance. Yeah, I, I put them in front. Keep the handles keep in, in front. front. You go behind. Or I, I, I would keep them in front. Keep okay. them in front. So just uh, there you go. Dude. Oh, shit. There you go. Go, go narrower. Okay. All right. Oh, shit. Oh, there you go. Keep 
Those heels down. There you go. What's so, up? oh my gosh. So right here, so here's the kit that you can get on strengthbands.com. If you look inside here, you probably got about 400 pounds worth of resistance yeah. there. What's that weight? Maybe five pounds? So you got 400 pounds worth of resistance in a five pound bag. That's just the latest one. Uh, if you go to strengthbands.com, you'll find all the pricing. Okay, cool. Well, that was intense, man. You got a pump, man. Here with John Anderson, former strongman competitor, also a professional wrestler. Yeah. We're going to put John to the test with the bands here. Have him try some shoulder press. <laughs> so how many pounds is this supposed to be equivalent to? 388. That's the equivalent of 88 pounds. Oh, right there, yeah. And then the total the total set is almost 400 pounds. Total set in the bag. Oh, okay. so this, yeah. So this is 88. The nice thing is, is the attachments will fit on any free weighted system so you can actually do it with free weight. When, when someone tries this, they'll quickly understand that the stability factor is a large part of this exercise. So it's not going to be as simple as one would realize. Absolutely. A lot of core will be involved in this as well. Appreciate it, John. Absolutely. Appreciate your feedback. Thank you so much. All right. John Anderson with MHB.